walk the line, the line I choose. I see the people in front of me. I climb the wall, the wall of news. I watch them show the After taking a very unexpected hiatus soon after the release of their self-titled debut album, Scars on Broadway made a triumphant return to the stage on August 20th, 2010, with a sold-out show at the Avalon in their hometown of Los Angeles, California. When lead guitarist, principal songwriter, and musical mastermind Darren Malakian took a leave of absence from the live stage, many fans were left wondering the reasons behind the abrupt end to Scars on Broadway. It seems there was no end at all as Darren had to take some personal time away from touring, all while continuing to write and record new material. With rumors that never seemed to die about a possible reunion with System of a Down, Malakian took to the stage with Scars, which no doubt delighted his fans who felt relieved to see him back on stage with his energetic and unique style. Artists News caught up with Scars on Broadway guitarist Frankie Perez to get his thoughts on getting back to the stage with the band, as well as his thoughts on the inevitable return of System of a Down. It's funny because people, when you stop playing, people automatically think the band is done. You know, that's actually never been the case. Darren had to handle some stuff, and we're going to play together for the rest of our lives. You know, whether or not System gets, when System gets back together. Yeah, I mean, um, we'll continue to do it. You know, it's uh, it's our own little Pink Floyd just on steroids. You know. I don't know. I'm not. I think I might have said too much. <laughs> It seems lead vocalist Serge Tankian continues to deny the rumors of a possible return while he readies his second solo album, but former system bassist Shavo Odajian recently spoke as if a reunion was only a matter of time. Judging by the response of Frankie Perez, who clearly has an inside track to Darren Malakian, it seems a system reunion is closer than one might think. System of a Down have been on an indefinite hiatus since 2006, which coincided with the band's last tour in support of their last release, the double album Hypnotize and Mesmerize, which was released separately and both landed at number one on the Billboard Top 200 chart in the same calendar year.